So in this video, in this box, we have what is called an intelligent planter. You can see that picture right there. This was sent to me for testing and review. So we're gonna get this unboxed. Obviously, um, just because of how long it takes plants to grow, we're not gonna be planting anything in this, but we are gonna unbox this, unbox this. We're gonna see what it comes with. So thank you for sending this to me, but everything in this video is all my opinion. They did not tell me how to make this video. So let's get this unboxed and let's check it out. So right away, it looks like we have our user manual. Very nice. Let's go ahead and put that off to the side for now. All right. Very nice looking. Looks like we have our different parts here. And then what's really cool about this, so we have everything that we need, right? To get it planted. We have our, like all of this stuff that we basically need. We have a fertilizer refill pack that it comes with. So looks like we have our like little dirt cones that is gonna go inside all of this. We have all of our, little potted plant areas. We have all of our labels that are included here, right? So everything that we need to get this up and going is included except, right? There's one thing that's not included and it says right here on this packaging, seeds not included. But we can kind of get this set up and see what it looks like. So let's put all these off to the side. All right, so this is what this grow well uh, hydroponic kind of system looks like when it's set up. I don't know if I really like where I have it set, but for now, this is where it's going to go. The reason why I'm not so sure about this is because this, obviously the top part light is adjustable. You can move it up and down. And I just kind of set these up really quick just so that you can kind of see what it would look like. Obviously I need to soak these sponges and I need to put actually seeds in them as well. Um, but really cool that they include all the little labels here. They included these little labels so that I could uh, put labels on those as well. I would definitely make sure to read your manual. And then they do include all of the plant food and stuff as well. And they include all these little covers like this. But let's go ahead and take this off so that you guys can see what the inside looks like. So I went ahead and put a little bit of water in here, but you are supposed to fill this up to seven liters. And then really quick, uh, I wanted to let everyone know this. So mine apparently came with the child lock already on. Basically what that means is none of these buttons will work. So if you have kids, you can turn the child lock on and then none of your buttons will work and you're going to freak out and you're going to think that nothing works here. I don't know if this is going to show up on camera, but if you see this little lock right here, it is should be on the camera. So mine came locked like that. So if I pressed anything on here, nothing worked. And I was kind of like, what's going on here? This is a dud. So basically you hold both of these down and you can see it unlocks. We can see it locks again. You want it unlocked. So we do have the pump right on in there. You can see that it's working. We can have, we can turn the fans on and off, right? So now the fans aren't on and they'll speed up, et cetera. Turn them off, you can switch to vegetable mode. You can see how the lighting just changed a little bit. And then we have our sleep mode. So very cool that we can do all of that. They do include, even though they don't include seeds, they do include the plant food here. Uh, and then they include a bunch of other stuff. I'm gonna go buy some flower seeds. I'm probably gonna grow some flowers in here. Very cool that we have this. I'm gonna, I'm definitely going to kind of go through that and probably pick a different location for this once I probably get like a side table or something to put this on. I'm not really sure 
where I want this, but I definitely wanted you guys to know about this child lock thing because you might think that your unit doesn't work because none of the buttons are working, but it probably still works. You just have this locked. So overall, very, very cool. I would say uh, you might want to consider putting like a tray underneath this. We do have that plug right down there, but remember that plug a lot of times, that's not just on this, but a lot of times these things are notorious for kind of leaking. So just something to take note of. You could seal that up better, something like that. But overall, this thing looks really cool. I'm excited to go get some flowers or possibly some vegetables to grow in this. Very excited to get this going, especially because it's getting cold outside. So having something like this will be pretty nice.